So I heard you wanted to be a movement god. I got what you need. Oh, he's back. He came back. He came back. Hold on, chill, chill, chill. All right, back. Say that. Say that. Again, you know I must say it again, Mr. Waves on Swim. So they hate on him is back with another fucking banger. So I heard you wanted to become a goat. I heard you wanted to hang with the big boys. I heard you wanted to be able to move with the big boys. I'm gonna break it down in this video how you can take your movement from beginner to pro. This might not have every single thing there is to know, I might have missed a few things, but I promise you, after you watch this video, ooh, you're going to be sweet. Don't forget to like this video. Drop a comment below. Let me know if it helped any way, any way possible. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. We're live every day on Twitch. If you want to see everything live, come through the motherfucking Twitch movement. Hit the follow button and watch the show. Also, if you want to join the community, link down in, in below to the Discord. Appreciate you guys. Hey, bro. First thing we're going to work on in the movement is going to be keeping momentum and wall bouncing. All right. So, so when it comes to keeping momentum and wall bouncing, we're going to start here. What you want to do is, let's say you want to get from point A to point B, but very fast. You don't want to be walking down the street, walking, or you don't want to be just up top, you know, trying to jump from roof to roof as slow as you are. What you're going to do is, keep momentum, and this is what it's going to look like. So you see how fast we're getting down the street by just b wall bouncing from wall to wall, or wall bouncing off the wall and sliding? What you're going to do is, jump. You're gonna slide, jump off the wall, slide. Jump off the wall, slide. Jump off the wall, slide. Jump off the wall, jump off the wall, jump off the wall, jump off the wall, jump off the wall. And then you can, you know what I mean, combo it back into a slide. That's gonna be called keeping momentum and wall bouncing. How, like, how do I keep my slide? Like, how am I sliding and wall bouncing? All right, so what you're gonna do is, it's simply going to be a wall bounce into a slide, a wall bounce into a slide, pretty much. Now you're going to be able to do it from either all wall, wall bounce slide, wall bounce slide. This should help you keep your momentum while moving around the map. Now, with the wall bounce slide, you can do it frontwards. I didn't do it that time, but you can do it frontwards like that, slide into it, or you can do it running for, uh, frontwards. So you can hit, uh, eject. And then you can also slide. I didn't do it right there, but eject and then slide. But I keep running to that one wall, so it's not going to work. There you go. All right, it's not doing it. But anyway, you're going to hit that. You're going to do the jump, hit the wall, eject, then slide. The tunnel movement and also the tunnel. He came back. He came back. Hold on. Chill, chill, chill. All right, man. Say that. Say that. Say that. Play. This is what this tunnel movement is going to look like. 
let's say that you're having a gunfight with somebody in this tunnel you guys are back and forth gunfight and gun battle and whatever whatever or let's even say you're you're getting chased you're getting out of there you know what i mean you're getting chased one or two people and you have to go to the tunnel there's multiple ways you can fight this now let's say that other person's on the other side of the tunnel you guys are fighting you can fight them like this that was a fail okay you can fight them like this or you, you want to jump in but you want to keep fire on my jumping in so pretty much what it's going to look like is it's going to look like something like that the tunnel isn't that um the tunnel isn't that long but you see what i'm talking about so what you're going to do is continue to keep wall bouncing while also firing your gun also and then depending on what depending on what character you have you can also come with that combo away too so just remember to keep wall um, keep wall bouncing but also shoot at the same time now that's for if you're pushing somebody or you're trying to push somebody out or you're fighting them in a the tunnel let's say you're getting really really chased in the tunnel you got two three people chasing you in the tunnel you're hurt you need to be able to get some heals off and everything or you need to, need to be able to fire some back shots that'll make it to me that listen we know <laughs> All right, all right, anyway, anyway, all right, so coming down the tunnel, he's behind you. What you can do is hit this wall eject. So what you're going to do is you're going to run into the wall, jump off the wall, wall eject, and then that'll have your killer line fire to be able to shoot at him when he's coming out. going to look like this. Bang, come on, do the turn, be able to slide right back at him. So that turns into, that's a, that's a very hard move to defend no matter how good you are, no matter, you know, if it's a good, bad, or medium player. Now, let's get over to the movement. We're going to get over to the movement, um, the movement healing. What I mean by that is being able to heal by also using your movement. I'm going to show you what that looks like. Let me, um, lose some health first. Right, so, let me show you, let me show you what this looks like now. All right. So, what I mean by the movement heal side, this also can go based off your character. Um, it can go based off of what type of, uh, movement you're changing. Let's say I was just in a gunfight, I'm, I'm this much damage hurt, you know what I mean? Or let's say I'm in a storm, but I need to keep moving. I need to keep moving while being able to heal. You can bring up your t uh, your pinwheel while also moving. And what you'll do is, hold on. Bring up your uh, pinwheel while also keep on moving. And you can heal literally in the air as long as you come back and either A, slide or jump off someone and slide into your heal. So what it look like is, let's say I'm up here fighting somebody. You know what I mean? We're, we're, we're going through a lot right now. I'm fighting, I'm fighting. He's pushing me. I need to pull back. I jump off. Slide. Go into a heel. Put on my shield. And I'm still sliding away. That's a lot of movement away. And I got away in a quick. I got away very quickly and very swiftly. So let me show you what it looks like again. Mind you, any character can get away like this. I'm just basing it off of the character I have now. You can't really show too many characters because uh, I'm in a training lobby. But... Let's say I get some shots off, or take some shots. He's pushing me. I push off. Even if I just needed to, even if I just need to slide off, jump off, slide. I'm down the hallway. Well, I didn't, I didn't combo right, but you get the point. I'm sliding away while also doing some very good movement to give me a step ahead. And that's what we're gonna call hill movement. Next, we're gonna get into strafe shooting movement. This is what strafing looks like. Strafing looks like when you're when you're crouching up and downwards and you're taking some good shots at somebody. So I don't really use this method much, but I have seen a lot of people do it. You can do it side to side. I feel like with a mouse is a little more probably a little looks a little more better. But since I'm playing on controller, it doesn't really look that good to me. But so you're fighting somebody down there and you just want to strafe side to side in certain gunfights. Now, also, that could turn into something like this, slide, and then you get down here, and then you're straight on like this. Now, like I said, I don't really use that mechanic too much, but I'm seeing other people do it, and you know what I mean? What may not work for me could work for you, so I just want to throw that in there and have you guys try that as well. All right, coming down to another mechanic. We're going to call this sliding. We're going to call this slide canceling, a.k.a. slide fight. All right, so what this slide canceling fight is gonna look like, right? Let's say you and a guy comes down to a street. You got, he's right here, I'm right here. Instead of, instead of, right, instead of us going straight forward and trying to shoot these stuff straight up like this, add a little razzle dazzle in it and make it be like, make it seem like you can't, he can't hit you at all. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna come up slide, 
keep sliding on them. Use some of your movement or whatever your ability is. Right now, I'm going to use that. Slide again. So this is what I mean by sliding to get your upper opportunity. Also, you never know that. That one jump off the wall, um, go into a slide, and then come back, jump, and then re-slide. If I came back, re-slide, he would have missed at least two, three shots right there. So that can help a lot of people when it comes to a gunfight. I like to call it at the sliding gunfight. Also, that helps a lot when it's on the roof. Let's say in the roof, per se, right? On a roof, I'm fighting someone on the roof. We're here, we're here, we're here. If I'm coming down, sliding down these little things and then run back up, they're missing shots right there, which allow me to get able to, you know what I mean, use my ability or whatever ability I may have at the time and also come back and slide back. So you can get some real good slides when you're on, on rooftops or where you're really down bottom and you're in a one-on-one -on -one gunfight with somebody. Trust me, it'll help a lot. All right, so guys, now that was pretty much all the basics. Now, honestly, what you want to do is learn to combo it. I think after you learn to combo, it is the best thing. So let's see, let's see what we have here. Um, let's say I need to get somewhere fast and run it down. Jump, fly, jump, fly, jump. I'm getting to my destination fast. I got a super jump. Um, uh, let's say I'm fighting this dude right here. Get some slides on him. Push off. Get another slide. He should be dead. It's all about comboing it, guys, and it's all about playing your character to the way of his ability. Like, as you guys know, if you watch a lot of my videos, I, I play a siren, so I'm able to TP, do my flash, you know what I mean? And other abilities like that, but let's see, guys. Let me know if this video guy helped you guys. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Have a good day.